Hello everybody, this is Dr. Bob and Dr. Kaysen Di Maria, and we want to take a moment or two to talk to you about the breast mammography that's going to be here at our Westlake office. Dr. Kaysen, what are those dates? So they, those dates are coming up, so January 29th, February 1st, and February 5th. That's the next time we're doing it here in our Westlake location. And I know that we're going to share with you just some quick tips on why you should consider this, especially if, you'd have, if you've had breast augmentation or you've had surgery on your breasts. You know, uh, so many ladies that we see in our practice have had their breasts taken off due to cancer, or maybe they've done it as a preventative. But I know that the blood has to flow up through your liver, and if your liver is compromised for whatever reason, your breasts cannot drain into your liver. So ladies, if you've had your breasts taken off, yes, you may be cancer-free because you don't have cancer in your breasts anymore, but the underlying physiology is still present, and we've seen this on the thermography, that you could literally have congestion in your armpit area that we have successfully seen go away over time. And then with the augmentation. Mm -hmm. What's really interesting is with breast augmentation, you do not want any type of compression on that breast tissue, especially for yourself if you had breast augmentation for a period of time. What's really interesting is on the thermography, in the reports that we're reading, actually it can show lymph congestion in that area. Even I've had some women that an added, I would say an added analysis of the thermography is it says that the integrity of the breasts are intact and That's there's good. no leakage because I know a lot of you out there, you're considering and wondering, well, the surgery that I had a period of time ago, should I go in for a follow-up to see if it's still okay? So with that being said, any woman with breasts, obviously you can come to see us. If you have tender breasts, heavy menses, cysts on your breasts, it'd be a wise, wise move on your part. And the good news with all of this, there's no prodding, no poking. I do the images here. I know Debbie does it in Naples and it's very non-invasive. It only takes a couple moments. And I know, especially if you're a woman, as early as 22 years old, you really wanna start thinking about what are you gonna to do to keep your breasts healthy throughout your stages and phases of life. And then we'll sit down and we'll go over those results and we'll come up with a protocol. So thank you, this is Dr. Bob and Casey and Maria in Westlake, Ohio.